well, come back to another one of my cooking around the world A to Z videos. Today we are be cooking a dish from Laos, which is a pork lab. In other words, basically a pork salad. Perhaps that's where the Elvis got the song from, pork salad only, we never know. Anyway, so that's what we're going to cook in this week. Hope you enjoy this one. If you do like this, please give us the old thumbs up. Do hit subscribe, do whatever you want. It's entirely up to you, but I do appreciate it. Anyway, let's uh, crack on over here again and see what ingredients we're going to be cooking with this week. It's a pretty quick dish as well, and it can be heat, eaten hot or cold. So let's get on over here and see what we're using. All right, pretty you know, simple ingredients for this dish. I think this will make a very good summer dish, especially with the barbecue season coming up. They can be eaten hot or cold. So anyway, so what we're using this week, we've got 450 grams there of a minced pork. Um, now we're using a rice powder. Now to do that, you need to get two tablespoonfuls of long grain rice, sticky rice, toast it in a dry pan, and then once it's done, just grind it down with a pestle and mortar or blender, get it as fine as you can. If it's got if it's not so fine, just give it a bit of crunch to the dish as well. Now I'm using three very small shallots here, finely sliced up. I've got three very small spring onions, very finely chopped. One red pepper there, one sweet red pepper, thinly sliced and diced. Now we're using about half a cup of coriander, half a cup of mint. So and I've blended that up so it's nice and fine. Also using a whole lime juice. And I also put a bit of the lime zest in there as well for you. And then we're going to be using two tablespoonfuls of a fish sauce. So that's all we're using this week. So let's get on over to the cooker and start cooking this up. All right, so I've got a bit of sesame oil cooking away in that pan, just heating it up first of all. So what we need to do first of all, we need to stir fry the pork. So let's put the pork in there. Let's get that stir fried up. So the first we need to do is just stir fry this pork. That's just coming along nicely that pork, so just keep turning it and stir frying it until it's completely cooked. Just break it all down so it's not in big lumps. That's going nicely. So now we put in the toasted rice powder. So if it's not completely into a powder, it just doesn't really matter because then the bits that aren't of a powder, just keep it a nice bite and crunch, so stir all that in. Give that a good stir. A bit. Now in there we're going to be putting the two tablespoons of, of fish sauce there. The lime, and I'll put a bit of lime zest in it as well. I'll just stir fry that for a couple of minutes, let the flavours mingle. Now you can put a little bit of sugar in this one, but I'm not going to leave that till the end. See if it needs a little bit of sugar at the end. And I'll be seasoning it with salt and pepper at the end as well. I'm not doing that straight away. Come on, lovely. And then what we're doing now is just basically add the red chilli, shallots and the spring onion in there. Just make sure all they're nicely mixed in and stirred in. So this is a pretty simple dish really, it's pork salad. Let's get that going on nicely. Then just put in the uh, coriander mint. That goes in. So this is really a one pan uh, dish recipe, this one. Coming on nicely. And then we just leave there for about 10 minutes or so, just until the onions have softened up. Here we go, that's cooking down nicely, the onions all softened up, all mixed in, certain smelly lime, the coriander, and the mint coming through with it. Now, now this is a pretty dry dish, if you want to make it a bit more wet, you can put a sort of cup full of water in there. I say, but this is a dry dish, so that's it. Basically, that's done pretty quick, this dish, pretty easy to make. So I'm now going to serve this up how I'm going to do it. 
and I'll show you how I'm going to serve it up. Right, so I've got some little gem lettuces. Put some lettuce leaves on the plate. I'm putting the meat in the middle. Now, I tasted it. Didn't need any extra salt and pepper or any sugar. It's actually come out perfect. Now, if you just get a spoon and just ladle a bit in the middle of the lettuce leaf. Now, this will be perfect for a summer evening. Quick dish, quite economic it will do. And these will make perfect little bites for your outdoor barbecue as well. So if you want it a bit more substantial, serve it with some jasmine rice, sticky rice, and put a bit of water in there just to give it a bit of liquid in there. So that's how I'm serving it. So let's give it a try with a bit of lettuce there. A little bit steaming hot. Let's give it a shot. Mm. For a quick dish, I'm going to call it pork salad. That is lovely. You can taste the lime, the coriander, you taste the mint coming through. And it's just got a little bit of kick there from that red chilli in there. So, again, that is very nice. Mm. There we go. One pork lab, or pork lab, I think they pronounce it. Or also on that, a pork salad from Laos. One pork lab. Or oh, pork salad, very nice. Feel that kick of that chilli coming through now. Mm. That makes a nice little side dish on that lettuce steak like that. So, very, very nice. I'll finish that off in a minute. So, very, very quick dish to do. Very, very tasty. So, I think that would be ideal with the summer months coming. To put as a side dish along with your barbecue stuff. I think people actually love that. But anyway, if you like that, please do give it the old thumbs up, like I said. Check in again next week. Next video, I'm going to be cooking a dish from Mozambique. Hopefully that will come out as well. As well. So, please uh, look after yourselves. Be kind to one another. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.